Yes guys and welcome back to yet another video on the channel today I'm going to be telling you how to trade properly during these icon swaps tokens That's right, you're going to almost double your coins with this method So what we're actually going to do is actually look at the um, objectives now So yeah, as you know, the icon swaps have come out, they're absolutely insane So make sure you do them So, looking at this, we've got icon swaps La Liga We've got icon swaps Bundesliga We've got League One and we've of course got the rivals, we've got weekend league, we've got 7 squad battle, match uh, squad battle matches of 11 Portuguese players, 11 Eredivisie players, 11 UCL players and 11 uh, silver players. So, to these um, sniping methods are actually very very easy and very very easy to make your money on. So what we're going to do right now is head to the transfer market. And as you saw then, we've got a, an awful lot of Ligue 1, um, Premier League and or just basically leagues um, for them objectives. So what we're going to do is actually very, very simple. We're going to filter by gold rare. Actually, no, we're going to filter by gold. Uh, we're going to go to one league what's in the icon swap. So Bundesliga is in it, Ligue 1 is in it and Serie A is in it. So what we're going to do right now is actually filter down to around, um, see how much you can buy them for, 800 coins. If you want what you can do is actually go to gold rare where you'll probably make a bit more money. So what we're going to do right now is see what the cheapest we could buy a player for. Another reason why these gold rares are also up in price is because of the fact that these SBCs are out the premium upgrade and the player picks. So as you can see here, 1.5k is literally um, the minimum you can buy a rare gold player from the Serie A for. 1.7k is probably the price you want to see other players at. So what we're going to do is actually sell the players at 1.6k and what we're going to do is simply take away tax so we'll go down to 1.3k and then snipe from there. Now not many players are going to pop up for me because I'm on the PC but if you're doing this on a PlayStation or an Xbox it'll work an awful lot. So as you can see here we've got Politano an absolute cracking bargain 600 coins and that is straight away so, um, 500 coins profit so send them straight away and if you carry on carry on doing this you're going to make an awful lot of money. The second one I want you guys to do is actually very, very similar. It's literally gold rare. Like I said, these are up in price a lot because of the SBCs out right now. They usually sell for around 800, but as you can see here, they sell for around 1.5k, which is an awful lot of money for a rare gold player who's 76 rated. Like again, filter down in price and yeah, snipe from there. The next one I want you guys to do is actually you snipe fodder players, and it's going to be the last method, but I'm going to give you a few players you can snipe doing this. So yeah, Rafael Guerrero is probably a very, very good one, because people want good Bundesliga players to shoot outside the box with, good La Liga players to shoot outside the box with, and yes guys, it's absolutely brilliant. So... That is basically going to be the three methods. I will show you some examples of these players now. So Guerrero, like I just said, you've got Aspas. He's also La Liga, which is what you need that long shots for. You've also got other players such as um, John Henderson, Paul Pogba. And guys, just go on to Footbin and filter by cheapest by rating, guys. And you're going to make an awful lot of money. So I'll quickly tell you how to actually... Um, another way of actually sniping these players, this gold rare method, is actually mass bidding. Now go to 1.2k. And as you can see here... 31 seconds left, you're going to go in all of these, bid all your money on them, and if you win them, bonus, if you don't, never mind, go again. So as you can see here, I've really not got the money because I'm on my alt account. But what I would do is simply invest in all of these. So um, he's already bid on him, um, you can up that to 1.4k because it's turned for 1.5k, um, 1.4k again, 1.4k again, um, again 1.4k. And then we can see, I'm actually going to add these to my transfer targets just to see how much they sell for, just to prove to you that this does work. So we're actually going to go onto this now and all, add all of these to our transfer market. Now, as you can see here, we're actually going to access our transfer targets right now. And right now you can see that 1.4k, 1.4k, 1.4k. Now, you probably, not gonna lie, would have got outbid. But if you carry on doing this method, you're going to earn a lot of money. You can down it to 1.3k, such as this right here. Now you do one thing. So yeah, you can down it to 1.1k uh, actually. And I'll basically make you a lot more money. Again, add to transfer target, um, 1.4k he is worth, uh, 1.5k. Uh, and there's a lot of players who are getting bid on very, very quickly. But guys, if you're quick on the market, you will be able to win these players. Just bid 1.4k because that is the maximum people are going to bid for these cards. So, as you can see here, these are going to be the only ones I want to do. So, I'll remove them from the thing. And as you can see here, 1.5k, 1.5k, 800 coins. So, you could have literally made 600 coins profit on Gertz there. Again, you could have made like 400 coins profit on him there. And yeah... 
Gerza still hasn't been bidded on, so you would have made an awful lot of money there. 850 coins, guys, that is so much money. And if you keep doing this method, guys, you're going to earn an awful lot of coins. So, guys, that is a quick video on how to snipe during these icon swaps tokens. If you did like the video, make sure to like and subscribe as it really helps the channel grow. Anyway, guys, have a nice day, have a nice week, and goodbye. And don't forget, subscribe.